Welcome back to Darkest Dungeon 2. While the flame still burns, hope remains. It's time to round out our victory of against the um, first of the Wisdom Inferno will Flames. Help you choose a path. Resourcefulness will ensure you survive it. The next one looks super brutal. Minus 20% max hit points. Combat start weaken. Wow. I really don't like that minus 20% max hit points. I don't care about the traveling heal. Even a combat start weaken is whatever, but we don't have to worry about that. Not just yet. Okay, let's unlock another pet. A little company for the long ride ahead. Interesting. When moving, plus 3% damage, one battle. Minus one speed, one battle. 20% chance, huh? All right, well, let's let's try that. I'm going to unlock. It is done. <laughs> I love it. I'm going to fully unlock the stagecoach. Get more inventory. I love what Wayne just said. It is done. Unlock refreshment, invigoration. I don't know that we need invigoration. Okay, so this is going to be... We got to bring the runaway to keep using some of your skills it might do an arsonist runaway oh i don't like that turn start burn 25 percent i kind of want to bring the occultist or the vesto i feel like i don't play enough with the occultist i could try a ritualist occultist that's more of a healer could be very effective um, I was thinking the final, uh, this is going to be ch Confession 5, Chapter 5, whatever. I kind of want to bring different characters who we haven't actually beat the Confession with. Um, and I only have three more stories left, right? The Flagellant, the Jester, and the Runaway. I want to bring two characters who don't have their stories done. So we got to bring the runaway. That leaves the flagellant or the jester. And as much as I want to keep uh, leveling the jester, uh, completing his story, I was going to save the flagellant for last, but I'm not sure that's um, realistic. The splendor of a world. Those who live within it. Yeah, let's bring a flagellant. And who knows, maybe we won't even get to the Flagellant story. We do Runaway. Ooh, I like this. Uh, some very interesting items. A little more light, a little more strength. Need to unlock more skills. Um, I want to bring myself. Humility fortifies the hand and the heart. Behind his unwavering shield, the peasant militia will rally. Indeed, peasant militia commander. Okay, I could come. A uh, flagellant can come. You can bring an occultist. A little worried about the DOTs. Also, always bring plague doctor. Plague doctor just is very, very good. Um, but I already brought a plague doctor. Technically, I didn't kill the kill the. Um, mini boss, whatever it was called, like the re reflections of the past, echoes of the past, uh, with the plague doctor. Just a little, I, I kind of want to try this arsonist runaway. I am slightly worried about this DOT. Uh, Vesto, doesn't the flagellant have a way to getting rid of that? Okay, we can figure all that out later. Let's to recall a thing, unlock some stuff. To make it real once more. Greek fire grenade, very good. We unlocked all the combat items. Every twinkling recollection is another implement at our disposal. This item looks sick. Minus 20% of all prices. Nice. Let's get like, maybe two trinkets. A drop of sanity in a sea of madness. Another insanely good trinket. Turn in randomly one of every type of 
good positive tokens or plus one stress, which who cares about that? A welcome advancement in the science of survival. Sneaker standard. Each hero on combat star stealth, 33% chance. Each hero on combat star if flame greater than 75%. Um, taunt. Eh, very questionable trinket. I'll do one more trinket. New instruments will help us diagnose the world's affliction and overcome it. Now we're talking Sparkle Ball. 15% chance to apply days, blind, weakened, vulnerable, or immobilized on an enemy. Um, very nice. It'd be great on a repost uh, build. Okay, I know I said I would unlock some cosmetics. Let's see if I can actually remember to do it. Tools and trappings. The regalia of a life. Okay. Let them be properly attired for the apocalypse. Wow. Okay, we're gonna, gonna the more they have try to that out. To, the harder they will fight. Let's fully unlock the plague doctor's the tree. The wounded have much to teach. She will study them and work tirelessly to treat their trauma. Indeed. Okay. What else can I spend my money on? Um. Hearts and minds will carry the day. Intrepid Coast. Resourcefulness, that seems like a good idea. Wholesome accomplishment is good for the soul. Maybe we can unlock a stagecoach thing. I don't know that Not we need that. Who have known fear and failure in ample portion. Might as well fully unlock the runaways path. Alright. Got more upgrades on the heroes we can do later, but for now, this will do. The road calls once more to its dark passenger. Let's see what sort of heroes we get before deciding. The house on the borderlands. Half swallowed by the stain. What world could be born of a mind so sharpened by appetence? The crossroads, where lost souls hope to find their way. Okay, let's see. What are our options? I just want to see what the flagellant skills are. He's a returning zombie form. So everything is blight. Fantastic. Let's see, punish, blight, pretty flexible. You can use this from the first three ranks. Fester clears a corpse and applies blight. That's pretty nice. Deathless, oh, you take damage, but you heal something for 25% and it's unconditional. That's interesting. Endure, ah, the classic endure. Yep, removes stress and puts it on you so you can stress heal. Lashes gift. Oh, so this is your heal. Wow, this is very interesting. Heals yourself for 25%, but buffs a target with strength and block and a stress. Seems very strong. You really need acid rain to be effective though. Right now you can't hit the back. All right, what sort of heroes we got? Amateur armor smith, pyromaniac, besto, eh. Early riser cultist, that could be good. I don't like this nervous, but uh, I like the speed. Plague eater, last gasp, neat freak, shadowborn, eh, fragile. Oh, why? I have no choice. Nothing I want to. Remains, save a burning will to survive. Want to do your story? Oh, that's rough. Better tactician, Hellion, Clotter. Selfish, man. I guess I'm gonna be Tried. selfish. More devastating than the horrors of a hundred campaigns. Okay, I'm changing my weapons. Let's see. I'm remembering the fashion, the cosmetics. So this is the default. Change weapon kit. I'm ran out default, right? Yeah. If I change to the sergeant, I have a different looking mace and a different looking shield. You know what? Let's let's take it. 
The answer is balance highwayman. Always nice. Oh, natural eye grave robber. This is so good, but... Ooh, pellet swap. Ah. Oh. Okay. And then pillager hater, darkly curious plague doctor. Eh. I think I stick to my original plan. Zalutri. An undying blight upon the soul. Oh, I want to hear what Wayne has to say about the cultists. To know the abyss, one must embrace it. All right, got to get rid of some of these negative quirks. Certainly very problematic, but we can work with that. I'm thinking on this final boss, I need to be a vanguard to do damage quick. Let's do the wanderer um, flagellant. I think I was going to do the arsonist. Sure. Warlock, too risky. Ritualist um, could be good. Can't use the sacrificial stab, though. Do something like this. Can't hit rank one. Up with our flagellant myself. Can I hit rank two? Yes. Vulnerability hex. You know, this seems a little better. Firefly, Herfly, Ransack. I mean, I might go forward. It's not impossible. This way I could equip a sacrificial stab. I think shadows is real interesting. Vanguard. Okay, we definitely want Retribution. Good old Retribution. Don't know that I need Defender. I love Strategic Withdrawal. What's a Vanguard again? Plus damage. Yep. Uh, the only thing that makes me nervous is this team has no way of dealing with DOTs. Actually, a pretty serious problem. Them to just bring the Vesto. Or the Plague Doctor. Ritualists can't get rid of DOTs, right? Um, how how else can I deal with DOTs? I know the Runaway, she can unlock a skill, Cauterize, that can clear out bleeds, which is very good. DOTs are no joke, like... Very concerned. I can't do sergeant. That's. I don't think it's enough damage. Final boss. Although. It is very uh, fitting. Sergeant with the sergeant weapon kit. Minus 20% damage. I can. I can work with that. I can. Um, I think I could work around that. Just worried about our damage. Ritualist is a bit more of a support. Uh, support tree. How else can I deal with the DOTs without bringing like a Vesto? I haven't played with this Seraph vest, though. That could be fun. Physician. It's kind of a support path. I think I would be the Alchemist Plague Doctor again, just because I need a Blight Piercing. Indiscriminate science. Stains the surgeon's hands. There's a lot of synergies here. Mm, I do like the occultist, but 
I think it's uh, hard to pass up on the Alchemist Plague Doctor here. Just want to try to do one of these runs without dying horrifically. I think I need that DLT cure. Yeah. I have no way of applying combos. Uh, that's not true. I have Strategic of Draw. And I have a smoke screen. Okay, we'll try some other um, other builds next time. I really need to unlock the stories before I think about like different paths and stuff. Okay, enough talk. Let's do this. Okay, welcome, Geji, our flagellant, Rippy, the arsonist runaway, and CO, our plague doctor, alchemist. Uh, and of course myself, the Vanguard Man at Arms. I'm still gonna change my weapon kit to the Sergeant. And I think that's it in terms of cosmetics. Let's do it. See if we can win. I'm gonna try, but more important is to keep unlocking these hero shrines and the stories. The road is yours to travel, but you are not alone. Plague, the plague grenade, sparkle ball will be good on me. Nautical compass. He also looks insane. I'm not even gonna equip this sneakers standard. I don't think we need it. You can feel it. A change in the air. The bulwark of your denial is giving way. Hmm. Big group. Okay, punish. Light. Oh, punish hurts myself. Interesting. A breakthrough. Breakthrough is right. Rush. Wait, why did I get a stress? Oh, the nautical compass. Okay. Yes, hit the flagellant. He likes it. Clear corpse. Adjacent monster is blight. Let's do it. Nice counter attack. Tempted to emboldening vapors, but building noxious blast is the way to go. Maybe not. Okay, endure, don't need that. Definiteless, don't need that. Fester, nah. Punish. Malaise. Okay, Measured so now we steady. will. What's your range? Analysis is the natural prelude the front two. To and the defender, get some block tokens. Nice. In this weighty gloom, a spark. I right, got some good loot. We would come here in summers of years gone. Fortune right. Crown. Think and rest. Zero percent negative relationships. That's fantastic. All right. Rain, fire, and rot. Is there no sanctuary from this madness? Thinking we want to go to the Fetter, avoid the Watchtower should be pretty, pretty easy, right? 
Land a killing blow on pillagers on myself. Probably do that. Use magnesium rain three plus times in a single fight. Uh, this is pretty easy doing a creature den. Otherwise, this is really difficult. Land killing blow on swine for Rippy. Scout a region with a watchtower on Gedji, which is counterproductive with our thing. Experimental remedy. Now, I don't quite understand how these signature in items work. Like, if I save this at the next end, can I get it again? That's actually really important to know. That's something like, I don't know how you would discover through playing the game without reading a um, resource, a, like a guide or something like that. That's one of the few things that um, the in using in items is actually pretty important to know. I have to look that up at some time in the future. Precious relics remind us of a time before the end. All right, we've got the usual orphan wolf cub. Always a good choice. Pygmy little skin. Also a good choice. And uh, mucilaginous slime, which... To be honest, I don't quite fully understand how to use that. Got a shroud almanac, but I don't really want to go to the shroud. Gnarly Knuckles is real good. Solid upgrade. Hmm. Got some whiskey flask, dartboard. Got some. Hold on. The next stop is leagues away. Plan accordingly. Oh. Only death for those who would seek to stifle us. That's why the negative relationships weren't coming into play yet. It's because I didn't equip the uh, item. Okay, let's see. Learn what can be taught. That you may stand just a little taller at the end. Gotta go to the feather. Those are really good items. I'm, I'm not super confident about beating the boss. I mean, I do have an immobilize. It's hold the line. It's just the boss has a lot of blight resistance. The boss, rather. I'm uh, not feeling a compelling need to fight the boss. Okay. What pet? Debuff resist is good. I need road gear item. Of which I have none. Also, if we want to fight the boss, we're going to need a lot more, uh, going to need to buy food. Like, good food. I might. I might fight the boss. It's not impossible. Let's see. Honestly, I gotta feel like the orphan wolf cub is the way to go. Pill skin. I don't remember that being very useful in the final boss. This slime would be useful against the final boss. Eh. I could buy a work table loom and combo right away with the orphan wolf cub, but those relationships are nice. It's more about avoiding negative relationships, I feel like. Rat maker's kit. I can't decide. I'm afflicted with paralysis here. Okay, let's buy the two whiskeys. I know I always do that. And I think since we might fight the boss, I will buy a apple and cheese to buff up the front. And then a stale bread. And we'll just eat the food. 
feeding the slime mode to CO because CO has excellent disease resist. Plus, we should have enough taunts to uh, be okay. We're gonna fight the boss. We need to buff uh, Firefly. Since that's gonna be how we do all our damage. Man, some of this stuff is good. I even buff Noxious Blast. I do have Blight Piercing. But Retribution is a little too good to not take. The two block po tokens, the taunts, all good stuff. Blasphemous Ido. Um, sure. Well, no. We'll save it. Save it for a better opportunity. Still can't decide what pet we go with. Larny, uh, Gnarly Knuckles is hard to pass up. A compass can go here. That's a lot of extra damage. I don't care about that stress. We have 30... I could buy a loom to produce a woven item. I just don't think it's even worth it. I don't care about woven items. I'm going to save my money. And then, so I have to decide what pet now. Maybe the slime to loot more row debris? I really don't think stress is going to be a problem. If this is negative um, relationship minus reduce uh, negative relationship chance, take the war from wolf cub, but don't need it. Pill skin might need heals in the final fight. Pretty solid. Still, our team has a lot of healing. Not worried about that. Let's do the slime. It cannot fight, but perhaps it can calm. None of these are road gear. Don't need. Sacrificial host is even tempting, but don't need it. I don't think. And buy a dart board. It could be a finny boost. Do that. Two glimmers. I think I saved the rest of my money for um, in items at the next inn. Okay, dart board. Let's um, let's have Gadget and Rippy try it. Nice. Ooh. Okay, that was a plus two. Is there any way we could have them get their affinity up even more? I don't think so. We have to gamble that a whiskey flask is going to do it. Nope. But Gedgy's using the flask to purify his wounds, apparently. Rippy. Usually prefer to keep a clear head. All right. I think this is good. Could use the experimental remedy, but... We might get disease, and I would rather save it. Um, save the rest of our money. The, yeah. the boss is not a priority. All right, let's do it. Negative relationship time. Oh my gosh. And callousness have claimed dominion here. Oof, I hate Geji, and he hates me. Not loving the flagellant in the front ranks. Okay, we can do it. We can work with that. It's fine. The rancid crop grows unchecked and abhorrent. Okay, don't know where the creature den is. Uh, yeah, I'm gonna pass on fighting the boss. Uh, very questionable. I have no combat items, no real trinkets. Uh, it's not the uh, strongest squad 
Got some negative cork. Nope. Hospital. But then we would be forcing the watchtower. I would miss my uh, mastery point. Don't like that. Creature dead. Now that we could be. We could do a assistance encounter into the cache. Do a creature dead. Question mark. And then pray one of these has a hero shrine. Probably go to the right. Does anybody have the void scouting thing? No. And again, we want to avoid uh, getting the loathing too high. Yeah, let's go left. Let's not lose the run when right away. Is exhausted. Trust your instincts. Ah, anti-venom. That's going to be handy. Okay, what are our options? We could get a stagecoach item at the cost of five flame, although Geji and me would hate each other, or Rippy can fix the stagecoach. I would rather see what the stagecoach item is. Geji, you have greater need of us than you know. All right. The Wayne Rider waits, eager to ply his trade. I mean, this is an item. We could use it in the next region. Uh, we'll have glimmers. We can we can get that torch up. We go to the assistance encounter again. Uh, try to get that flame up. The cash, though, I think is just so much better. Is your coach prepared for the upcoming obstruction? the opening. Play grenade is gonna save the day. Yep, these DOTs are concerning, but it's it's okay. Don't need to endure yet. Don't punish. Uh, let's bring it up front. Ragger, taunt, that's not a bad thing. How did that one resist the burn? I have the arsonist, the piercing. But it's got 50% burn resist. That's why. Okay. Retribution. Good old retribution. Nice. More like it. Don't want to fester. Now, Deathless is real interesting, because then I might be able to indiscriminate science. I could also endure to get some of that stress down. But, nah. Let's just kill. The fiend's strength dwindles. Auto compass finally doing work. Crush would inflict a vulnerable token. Let's defender. Maybe uh, that'll increase affinity. Any heals? Nope. The smallest variable can make all the difference. Hmm, that stress is certainly piling up. Don't like that. Alright, these enemies are all dead. So, how can we increase affinity? Maybe a battlefield medicine? No, that didn't do it. Sweet reprieve. Until the next test is Minor cleansing you. sensor. That's very nice. Disease resist. Ooh, Geji is now basically completely immune to disease. I like that. Let's 
slime mode. The Wayne Wright awaits. Eager to cash. Fly his trade. Ah, good stuff. This was to absolutely worth it. Ouch of lime. Probably gonna need that. The next region, fire grenade too. We're gonna need my ma um magnesium rain. Indiscriminate science without upgrade. It's not that great. Uh, corrupting cleaver. I'm actually going to give this to Geji since Geji has no blight piercing. He really needs it. Got food. Good stuff. Okay. I wanted to go to the creature then for sure. the oblivion's tear but the creature then will reduce loathing so it all work out the loathing whispers sharpen your blades that we may properly excise our portion all right let's see I like the glimmer I like the anti-venom Greek grenade, yep. Greek fire. Pouch of lie. Do I want that? Oh, nah. Magnesium rain would do just as well there. Okay, this is the fight where we use magnesium rain three plus times. Oh, right. I was supposed to kill pillagers. Did I actually? I killed one pillager. We'll see if we can uh, manipulate that in some other fights. Gotta remember these hero goals. I feel like I have to check it before every single fight. Otherwise, I can't remember. Just double check my skills. I don't know if strategic withdrawal is actually the way to go here. Command removes blind. That could actually be useful. Because a lot of uh, there's a lot of blinding in this, this zone. Her flight is real good, it can clear it dodges. Okay, let's do it. Definitely fighting this. Geji, my skin shall know the rake of their claws. Or Rippy. Looks awful closing. Geji. Uh, or flag flagellant. My skin shall know the rake of their claws. I'm gonna be pretty good, but thinking we open with a firefly that's okay uh glimmer Hot. punish good in a magnesium rain. On to the next. One down. You might eat. Okay, you didn't eat. That's good. Maybe Measure because of the taunt. Violence, then apply it judiciously. Hmm. Ransack would move me forward. I don't like that. I can run and hide, but thinking actually. Conclusion. Huh, smoke screen. I How do crits work with like smoke screen, I wonder? I'm gonna use that corpse clearing ability on the flagellant, what's it called? Fester? Yeah, it'll make me unhappy, but who cares? Well done. Play grenade. Actually, maybe not. Can Crush reach the uh, third position? Beauty yes. Imperfections. Sure. Malaise. Measured and steady. 18 damage crit there. Nice. I love it. Okay. Should be able to heal this away. Let's set up for the next turn. Not yet. Okay. 
Okay, we're going to Glimmer. Retribution. I'm just setting up. And then let's do a little endure action. There is comfort in company. Both dead. Simple variable, easily resolved. Hmm. This is gonna spawn in the enemy. I have the stealth, I'll be okay. I think uh, starting to do some damage is more important. think we need a fire grenade. Alright. Burn that one. Magnesium rain. A slow dissection. An unavoidable end. Tokens are gone. All right, we could do another retribution. Rabies, that's fine. That's not even that bad of a disease. Don't like that minus 5% max health, but otherwise like pretty irrelevant. Poster, get that uh, stress slightly down. Uh, Flagellant has a unique stress mechanic, just like in Darkest Dungeon 1, where uh, he becomes toxic. Now, it does cost affinity, so I want to avoid doing that if at all possible. Okay, we need to drag this out until I can magnesium rain one more time. Opportunity squandered. Good affinity improvement. All right, that's a gazillion negative tokens, but fight through the fatigue. Flagellant doesn't care. I think that's the third magnesium rain. Right. Yep. All right. A breakthrough. That should be a death store. See if we can get a uh, heal. Yep, listen and follow my lead indeed. Lash's gift. Sure. Increase my stress, but does a heal. Yeah, I really don't like this burn. Can I resist the burn from the arsonist? A brilliant conclusion. Look screen. Mostly, I'm just doing this to try to sneaking some more healing. Easy enough fight, but. The party's not feeling super strong right now. All right, here we'll go complete. That's good. Vintage collection. Ah, yes, I remember what that is. The wine or relationship buffs. They thrill to the succulent flavor that grows up from some nightmare pit far beneath the earth. 
burn cell. That's actually useful. All right, this I I don't know. This um, I feel like this event is unbalanced. The strange wine just always seems better in almost all circumstances, unless my affinity and stress is super under control. This is just so much better. It's um, four wines, right? And you get eight affinity pips out of that. Now, the blood is a very strong combat item, and in the right situation, I think it can be clutch, but affinity is even more clutch. And stress reduction early on, it's just so much better. Alright, well, we have two paths. They're relatively unknown. Path on the left can't possibly increase um, Oblivion. This is where I wish I had the scouting. Actually, pretty tough choice. Can I, if I don't scout that, do I know what the Oblivion Terror situation is? I think I go to the right. As much as I want to do that combat, I'm like, this is too guaranteed Oblivion Terror. Really, really, really don't like that. We venture blindly forth okay. at the mercy of the road and its myriad dangers. I don't care about the uh, losing the armor on the stagecoach. What is that? A hoarder. Hmm, that's not so great. But we might be able to get something decent here. All right. Prices are at least oh a say gear. I mean, price of pride. I can't afford any of this except the greater burn shield, which I don't need. But a say gear. I could just win. Yeah, especially early on. Yeah, that's the correct choice for sure. Minor Protectorate. Well, no healing isn't bad. Minor Wolf's Blood is also pretty decent. I do quite like that Minor Wolf's Blood. Little extra speed in the right situation is very good. It's pretty cheap too. All right. Then, what else do I buy? Dread of Decency, but I don't actually think I need it. Not against this particular exemplar. Um, but still, it's, it's worth considering buying two of those just to basically guarantee victory against the exemplar. Don't think we need poetry. Whiskey bottle seems good. Buy one of those. Something to ease the rigors of the road. I do like the idea of having some glimmers. We're going to have so much relics. Like... Let's uh, buy three glimmers. I think I buy two of these just to, like, make the exemplar a free fight. I don't think I need anything else from here. This, this run is starting to come together, I think. Let's equip the Wolf's Blood Trinket on... Eh, not Seal. His hit points are very low. Rippy. All that matters is the flickering torch you bear. Okay, our armor is going to be completely wrecked. Hero Shrine, perfect! Just plating is spent. We are exposed. All right, our Rippy, our, um, what am I saying? Why am I blinking on this? Our runaway, my painful memories hid from the warmth of their love. Chapter two, beloved. Good fortune is a rare and wondrous thing. She straggled from place to place, drenched and hungry, until a kindly woodsman and his wife happened upon her. 
childless themselves, they welcomed her into their home, where she warmed herself in the glow of their hearth and hearts. Kindly woodsman and his wife. We all know this is not going to end well. Got cauterized. This is a very nice ability. Uh, if the target is bleeding, and I think bleed is the most common DOT, you can just heal 25% and remove that bleed. And it's unconditional. It doesn't require... Uh, I mean, I guess it requires that a uh, target is bleeding, but otherwise it's unconditional. Pretty good. Equip that right away. Oh, we're gonna have a uh, battle. Okay, wow. Um, what? Uh, let's equip some items to make this battle go quick. Uh, smelling salts? Uh, the Greek fire grenade will make it go quick. I don't think we need anti-venom here. Let's equip a... Uh, I mean... Smelling salts, I think. Glimmers. Sure, why not? Get that torchlight up a little bit just so it's not completely horrifically problematic. Oh, you gotta be kidding. This is the ambush? There's a cannon? I didn't know you could get ambushed by a cannon. That is nasty. Okay, well, we gotta target the pillager in the back. Target this one in the front. Shell shock, that's actually okay. Uh, still got a retribution. It's my best way of doing damage. Load shot. Okay. Analysis Boom. is the natural prelude to action. Because your crack shot's gonna die. How am I actually gonna beat that cannon? It's got DOT resists. I have no way of inflicting DOT. Let's see if we can possibly blind it. What's the um, debuff resist? It's only 30%. Okay, I mean, it could have blinded it. I don't think any of these other abilities are gonna do anything. This is gonna suck. Oh, a misfire! Fantastic! Endure can't hit. I mean, I have to fester. I mean... Writ large. Didn't actually do anything. This is very problematic. Oh! Getting stabbed in the back? Because of the hateful? Sure. There's two blinds. Okay. Now this will at least let me land a giant hit with myself. Really wish I had a boat ending vapor here. Other misfire. Ah, okay, okay. It doesn't have the block pluses right now. So... This is our chance to chip away at it with a puny amount of damage. But it's at least something. Ransack, move forward one. That's 11 damage. Sure. Seems a little too important. Alright. Almost. We're almost there. Another ransack. All 
Alright, we got this. Good thing the cannon's so slow. Got an armor the timbers creak, pit back. The wheels groan, but we press on nonetheless. Indeed. Okay, Oblivion's Rampart. Now let's. Don't need glimmers here. Burn salves are gonna be handy. And I think the smoke bombs are always nice. And a fire grenade too. Okay, let's let's just double check. Do I need bellow for this fight? I don't think so. Command's pretty decent. Cauterize, yep. Cauterize is gonna be good. Okay, let's do it. An altar all the way in the back. We can deal with that. A fire grenade. Dissection. An unavoidable end. Nice crit. Okay, we're gonna command that away if necessary. Oh, right, this is the uh, knockback. Completely forgot about that. Probably gonna have to equip hold a line just to counter this nonsense. All right, the altar is dead. There's gonna be 80 million stress hits. That's not great. We don't want to turn toxic, but we may not have much of a choice. I think it's time for a retribution. Nice. Knock back. Max not necessarily the worst. Uh, oh, ounce of prevention. Might go toxic here. Steady yourself. Um we could defender. Liking a burn cell here. Ulster. Actually gonna defend her like this. Good smoke bomb. This should kill you. Nice counter attack. Man, this uh, burn from the arsonist—it's so bad. What counter is it? Like, maybe I should have bought that greater burn resist trinket. A calculated generosity, but a welcome one nonetheless. Okay, retribution. Good burn sound this way again. Mostly because I feel like we're gonna have enough items. Retribution is not actually gonna do anything right now. I'm trying to see if I can get max bolster value, but it may not be realistic. Cauterize again. Ransack that. Just want to finish this. Alright, they're both dead. One. Command, maybe that'll increase affinity. Nope. 
Yeah, sure, a nice heal. In crisis, no gain is insignificant. Wounding words might need that for the damage. Vanguard Men at Arms abates. has extra hit points, so 47 is still pretty solid. That's plus 50% damage. If I can find a good dark impulse trinket. I'm not I'm not sure. I haven't quite figured it out yet. Okay. Good first region. A fortifying meal, a strong drink, and finally, rest. Fire is lit. The table is set. The inn awaits its favorite guests. Seal is a neat freak. Geji gains flawed release. That's terrible. I have a bum leg. But we are at the good doctor, which cures all of our diseases and basically eliminates all of our stress. And I have five mastery points. It's pretty good. The next stop is leads Sluice? away. Plan accordingly. Uh, equip. Good. Say gear. An improvement. Gonna equip everything. Then let's fix up the armor. The roads are rife with peril. A little protection is always welcome. Since the wheels can fix themselves, a say gear is gonna like carry us to victory. But fairly priced. Wild T. Seems good. Oh, appalling apron. We have to find this. This is how I uh, turn the runaways uh, problem into a strength. Okay, what else can we buy? Whiskey barrel. I'm actually not sure that's the best choice. Let's get this wild tea. Gotta, gotta get rid of this fragile nonsense. So bad. Okay. Ragger and Flawed Release are selfish. These are all pretty bad. What's your uh, positive court Geji? Fisher Focator? Water? Eh. Then did buy another Wild Tea. Stimulants could be good in the final battle. Going to Swine Country. Probably a whiskey flask for a little gambling, but we have ways of guaranteeing. Well, maybe not guaranteeing. You know what? Let's let's buy one whiskey barrel. A let's see how it goes. On the road to damnation. That went very well. Okay. I think I can get everybody's relationships up to at least friendly. Boxing gloves isn't a guarantee though, but this basic whiskey flask is. I think that's what I would do. I'm, I'm tempted to buy two stimulants and save them for the very, very final fight because I have a feeling I'm going to need them. Um, slime mode. Gedji's got insane disease resist. You can eat it. Seal can eat it. Tempted to just eat some like food that's not the most impactful. Okay. Listen. Practice. Improve. About to go to the um, sluice. Noxious blast and play grenade. Uh, Indiscriminate science. I think it's time for that. Noxious Blast, just a very good upgrade. Bolster. 
Bolster is too good. It needs to be nerfed. It can heal up to four stress, which is absurd. Even um, even a jester can, up after upgrading, can only heal three stress. I think the way Bolster should work is um, maybe it starts off with healing one stress, and when you upgrade it, it can heal two. Still be pretty decent. Flash's gift is interesting. Maybe just upgrade the basic punish. Is that a decent amount? Cauterize upgrade. Eh, I don't really need that. Run and hide. Ransack. Um, smoke grenade. Ounce of prevention is honestly not terrible. Crush is also just like, I think we probably upgrade that. Very, very solid upgrade. Okay. Let's get everybody happy. Edgy and me. Then we'll buy two basic whiskeys. Something to ease the rigors of the road. CO and me. I just need to get everybody so they at least don't have negative relationships first. Alright, Geji and CO. Again. Nice. Okay. Trying to save some of these uh, for a another wild tea. Let's do it on Geji. Ragger. Got rid of Fisher for Hater. I don't really care about that. Was it Geji and Rippy, right? Yep. Then repeat and seal. All right, at least nobody has any negative relationship. Our chances for a positive one are not great, but I don't really care that much about the positive relationships right now. Okay, we use up all our resources. Um, let's eat. Experimental Remedy, we could save this. Songbook of Rousing Tunes. Do we need that for this upcoming region? Not really. I do think it's time. Sparkle Ball. Go on Seal. Arlene Knuckles. Go here. Something like that. Don't need that standard. We'll save the rest of these resources. And let's go to the sluice. I'll do it in this episode. Hey, we even got a positive relationship. Tried and tested. A bond to be counted on. Searing Strike gives dodge plus, and Fester gives a strength token. I'm not going to use... I mean, I might use Fester from time to time, but I'm not going to use Searing Strike. Tread carefully and quickly. This is swine country. One has a candle and the other doesn't, so that makes the choice pretty easy. Fantastic. Um, let's make sure to equip good items for that. Holy water is good here. Earth light's actually really good in the creature den. 
Rip Searing Strike, you never know. Magnesium Rain, of course. I don't think we need bandages. A Pouch of Lie. Clear corpses? Nah, we have so many ways of clearing corpses. Bandage might actually be useful. Okay, this seems good to me. Yes! Let us see what fiends await! Oh, the dogs! Let's do a her flight and just get rid of all your tokens. Leg grenade. Retribution time. Miss, but that's fine. Wow, that is like sickening amounts of damage. The enemy weakens okay. and wanes. How am I doing so press your advance? 16 damage. That is so unbelievable. Need the magnesium rain to get rid of those corpses. This might just be my final trinket loadout. It's so sick. Huh. Okay, I kind of want, again, a setup turn. And again, I think when it dies to DOT, I get a free turn next turn. Nope. Don't get a free turn. That's okay. Her flight. Get rid of some of those tokens in the back. Play grenade. Even manage to hit. It's fine. Spit. No problem. Counter attack. A simple very OP. Easily resolved. Okay. Can holy water to just remove this negative token, but I don't even think I need to do it. Fester. Get rid of that corpse. Ooh, okay, gotta get the taunts up. Th those uh those munches are gonna hurt. Good resist though. No taunt. Hmm. And command myself. No, I can't command myself. That's defender. Very worried. Let's get that spider. Don't like that spider. All right, it wants to eat. I don't really care. It could be a nasty crit, but not really that problematic. Now for the taunts. Indiscriminate science would be pretty sick. Opportunity squandered. I cauterize that, but no nope. writ large. Alright, some negative tokens. That's fine. You heal that away. Ashes gift time. Yep, I was thinking a cauterize right here seems pretty good. Come 
replenish. No heals possible. Make sure to kill that one. Because a crush put you on death's door. Beautiful. The past is gone. Let it die. Remove disease and two mastery points if I deliver it to the inn. More excited about the, the two mastery points. I want all the masteries. Say you're already getting us insane value. Swine cash. Excellent. Right awaits. Eager to ply his trade. Contraptions. We got more food. Staggering striker. Probably not going to use that. Burn salve is useful. As is the crow's feet. Staggering striker. I'll be honest, we're never going to use this. But don't have to throw it out yet. Also got a carriage lamp somehow. Eh. An elementary problem. All right, I mean, these are the exact same, so it doesn't matter which choice I make there. There are rumors these rancorous beasts have some demonic spark of otherworldly intelligence. All right, I'm going to fight this Warren. Seal, how fragile they appear before our solidarity. Ah, oh, Squine Skeever, that thing. Okay, 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 okay. Gonna Malays use our crow's feet and, steady. and then Firefly. We know the target we have to kill. A brilliant conclusion. Brilliant conclusion is right. Deathless is not gonna help us here. But a punish on the carrion either in the front could do work. Oh! Turn one kill on the skeever. I love it. I might eat. But that's, again, totally fine. Just bleed them all again. May outwit them yet. Earth light will get rid of that fence. And we're gonna play grenade. It's all fine. That one's gonna die from the DOTs. A resounding response. Ooh, but we can fester. More fun and shenanigans. Go ahead, hit me. I like it. A small foundation of trust. Cauterize. Getting value. The fiend's strength dwindles. And a retribution. This thing's just gonna be on death's door. There's no reason for me to even do anything else. Deathless, sure. I haven't used that skill yet. Another impediment cleared with impunity. Cut down these nightmares and blaze the trail to your redemption. Cleared with impunity is right. Okay. Annotated textbook. This is really good if I can get the medicinal herbs. Those are really good if I have melee, which this is not a melee play doctor build. But a good find if I can get medicinal herbs. Big if. I'm just gonna ditch this staggering striker. I'll be real, like I'm never gonna use that. This uh mixture's javelin could be decent. Oh, right. I was supposed to get kills on the shrine, uh, swine with completely forgot. On our runaway. 
Okay. We'll see if we can manipulate this to, uh... Do it. Noxious Blast here. Deathless. Nope. Flash's gift. I like that. Can't retribution. It's gonna hit the pig in the back. smash that's fine we'll bolster that away okay make sure if javelin would kill but let's save that for a better kill opportunity i like the magnesium rain to clear the enemy weakens and wanes with bolster opportunity dodge squeal I think that ups my stress that's okay can deal with that the flight's not gonna do what I need it to do burn this road cannot be walked alone the heal going I'm trying to like set up. I'm gonna guard. Here. Traveled, trapped, held captive by fear. Four to eight. All right. I know exactly what we're gonna do. We're gonna let the swine weaken. Discriminant science heal. This could kill it. I can't risk that. Deathless, sure. This like nonsense trying to do the hero go. Just like piling up my stress. Two to five, that's not a kill. How do I do just a little bit of damage? That will do just a little bit of damage. Can't bolster or anything. Okay, endure. Distribute that stress. Okay. And then the matrix tablet. Beautiful. A simple variable. Easily resolved. In this weighty gloom, a spark. All right, completed the Runaways Hero Go. Doing very well on these Hero Goes, even though I personally think they basically not a matter. But whatever. They need to give a buff for the run. That's how you uh, make the Hero Goes matter. Uh, not fighting a Shambler. <laughs> no, no, no. This this team would not do well against a Shambler. So we're not going to try fighting that. Let's... Okay, not a shambler. We can get trinket or food, or we can get a positive uh, quirk or food. The unknown. What is this? 
Reckon the old shoulder still has it. Anyone there? You have until three. What is this? Is this the padlock that increases the virtue? No, that was something else. Let's see what this trinket is. Amidst the spoils, Whoa. an artifact of unparalleled power. Murder weapon. Apply on crit. Instant kill, 15% chance. Ineffective against bosses. I mean... Sure. Rippy, you do extra crit. Then who can use a nautical compass? I guess you can still use it. Because what if you get the crit token, right? And then the minor wolf's blood. Eh. Keep it around for now. We've got a spore grenade too. Fantastic. I'm gonna ditch the pouch of lie. We're never gonna use that. Sneaker stander. Never gonna use that. Got some more food. Still got inventory space. What matters? Fantastic. The fire is lit. The table is set. The inn awaits its favorite. Guests. Seal gains the yips. Rippy gains the yips. Geji has a uh, lazy eye, but it doesn't matter. He has no range skills, and I'm sickly. Not really a problem. I got two mastery points from that. That was pretty worth. And a gazillion relics. Precious relics remind us of a time before the end. We have many ways of buffing our relationship further. Seems worth. What are our options now? Everywhere in ruin. Everywhere in need. I don't want to go to the shroud. I am worried about the Leviathan. Not feeling super good about our odds. Experience, however painful, is the greatest teacher of all. What that hero shrine scouting item? Each improvement, a new variable in the equation of your fate. My urgent table, don't really need that. Carriage lamps. Oh, I need road gear. Okay, well, I mean, that. Experimentation. Your academic instincts serve you well. Yeah, the Hero Shrine map is nice, but... Not feeling great about our chances against the... Boss. Uh, you need move resist. And you need abilities to buff your damage. Like non-DOT damage. Don't see that I have that. So I think I have to go to the Fetter. Harvest Child would be pretty straightforward. As long as he uses Hold a Line and Mobilize. Kind of a free win. And we have the Holy Water, right? This time I'm going to remember to equip it properly. Okay, well. I will have to take care of that in the next episode. Thank you for watching. Until next time.